What makes you think that I'm an answer if you ain't mine? Even if you call me. All right, ladies and gentlemen, new grift. God damn. New grift. New grift. New grift. New grift alert. Okay. Another day, another grift. Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got to talk about Bandai Namco. Oh, Lord, say it ain't so. Guys, this one right here hurt me. This one right here hurt my heart. The the DEI grift has reached the east. And you can't make this shit up. <laughs> God damn it. You can't make this shit you up. You can't make it up at all. You can't make it up. Okay, the DEI grift has reached the east. Before we get into it, though, the Squabble Shop is wide open. Okay, get yourself a t-shirt, a sweatshirt, a coffee mug, a water model. A, a water what? Wow. You stupid. A water bottle, a bag. All of that. If you want to be a squabbler, you got to learn how to squabble, okay? Also, guys, we do a live show every Friday, 4 o'clock Eastern Time, right before we go into New Black Street with Kata at 6 p.m. Eastern Time, okay? Guys, we are at 12,100 and something subscribers. We are trying to get to 15K before the end of the year. Can we do it? Let's increase your ESG scores by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. Please, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Please, all right. Let's go ahead and get into it. Get into it. Bandai Namco is embracing DEI. No. Nigga, did I just dox myself again? I sure goddamn did. I sure goddamn did. I'm gonna have to cover that up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to cover that up. God damn it. Anyway, uh, <laughs> guys. So anyway. Um, this is from Ben Napco. Uh, he also shared an episode where dreadlocks, one of the hairstyles that can be selected in the character creation of Blue Protocol, okay, was added in response to feedback from overseas partners. Akuma said that when he first experienced the feedback, there is no representation in that game. He was shocked and thought, so that's what diversity is. Not being represented not only means that the need for self-expression is not met, but it also, I mean, but it may also be that uh, the identities of many players are not imagined. And I realize that not expressing something may nullify the existence of a certain person even before it leads to discrimination. Discrimination. God damn. So, I don't want to sound like a hypocrite on this, but to be fair, I have played a lot of Japanese games where I felt like, nigga, what a nigga hair at. <laughs> like, come on, bro. Y'all play, played them. Y'all played them early Souls games, dog. Like, if you was black and you was playing a Souls game early, nigga, you stood no fucking chance. <laughs> you stood no fucking chance, nigga. You looking at these fucking hairstyles like, nah, that ain't it, y'all. <laughs> that ain't it at all. Nigga, the, the skin colors was always, like, it was never black. It was never brown skin. It was always, like, gray skin. Like, nigga, what the fuck is this? Is this what Japanese people think niggas look like? So I got to be fair, okay? I got to be fair. Now, Am I going to go and tell the Japanese that they need to include black people in their game? Fuck no. Okay. I don't play your game to be fucking included. I play your game to experience the world through your eyes in this super imaginative, fantastical world. But I don't have a problem with you adding dreadlocks to the game. Okay. I don't. I really don't. All right. I really don't. So I'm not going to sit here and pretend to be outraged. If, if inclusion, okay, is just putting dreadlocks in a game what are we talking about <laughs> what are we talking about guys all right uh oh fuck no oh my god Tranny 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 jesus christ you just had to i was trying to defend you but d d transgender cisgender exgender what the fuck is s gender what the hell was that what the fuck is x gender Guys, what in turnation is going on? Bandai Namco has implemented DEI, uh, has implemented a DEI training program after a representative from the Quality Assurance Department learned of the initiatives from Western Partners. The program is comprised of four core tenets and uh, uh, to supposedly achieve broader appeal. Anyone who isn't completely brainwashed by this agenda understands that the concept of uh, the concept accomplishes the exact opposite of assuring quality. It's an abomination that ruins creativity by turning all fiction into uniform slop that carries water for destructive worldview. I can't, I can't disagree. Me forcing a bunch of Chinese people to put black people in their games 
makes no fucking sense when I know good and goddamn well Chinese people don't like niggas. It makes no sense. It makes no sense. So you're like, oh, well, why would you play a Chinese game, bitch? Because I'm a gamer and it looks good. The fuck? I don't care. I don't give a fuck. If the KKK make a good game, guess who's playing it? Uh, you know what? I might have to edit that part out. Hey. <laughs> I might have to. Hey, I ain't even gonna lie. I might have to. I just might, Kurt. I get it. I actually accept you staring at me like that this time. <laughs> I might have to edit that part out. <laughs> Maybe not the KKK. Maybe not the KKK. Okay. <laughs> Man, fuck that. Should I still play it if it's good? Fuck that. Fuck not. Uh, uh. I don't know. <laughs> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. Japanese studios have stopped listening to Western studios. Uh, oh, Japanese studios have to stop listening to Western studios and branches as they're not truly representative of the audience. All they're doing is using fiction as a vessel for one uh, for the one true worldview to cultivate. I like that. I like that saying the one true worldview. Ooh, that's that's a bar. The one true worldview to cultivate an environment where everything conforms to it for complete sociopath, uh, socio-political control, okay? People who enjoy Japanese games like them because of the different perspectives and unique style, they don't need to be made with some imaginary global audience in mind because they're appealing on, uh, on their own merits without outside input. Here's the thing to my Japs out there. The people you are trying to appeal to, it ain't gonna happen. I'm sorry, okay? Niggas, and I'm talking about blacks, Niggas don't play Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy not because it don't have niggas in it. They don't play Final Fantasy because it's just not the type of game that niggas play. Every nigga has the Negro Casual Collection. That's Madden, 2K, Grand Theft Auto, Call of Duty, and insert whatever fighting game here. Sometimes it's boxing, sometimes it's Street Fighter, sometimes it's Tekken. That's the most casual you know, Negro casual collection. A gamer is a gamer, period. You're either a gamer or you're not. And that's what I had to learn growing up. Not growing up, like like in my 20s when I first bought the Xbox One, I said, hey, man, I'm no longer sticking to just this Call of Duty Madden formula. I want to branch out and play new shit like Dragon Age, like Dead Space. You know what I'm saying? Like Chivalry, like For Honor, like Mass Effect. Like Baldur's Gate. I had to branch out and play those things because I'm an actual gamer. These niggas you trying to appeal to are not gamers, bro. They don't want to play shit that requires them to think too much. And you should see with Concord, Dustborn, Flintlock, all of this shit. Get you some what you need to do. And, and if there's anybody who's Japanese that's in my comments, okay? Anybody who's Japanese, or just not even just Japanese, just just Asia in general, what you need to do is you need to get a translator to come over here and talk to the actual gamers who are on YouTube. We'll tell y'all niggas, this is all cap. Bandai Namco and other Japanese company embracing this nonsense are only throwing away their own identity to mostly unknowingly perpetuate lies based on the falsehood that this is what Westerners truly want. And, and exactly, that's cap. It's not what we want. All this, Mira said, was in service of her rolling out a Bandai Namco's new in-house DEI training program, which, in court, according to her, consisted of four key pillars about character hair, character gender, uh, gender differences in culture and values, and accessibility. The only one I don't have a problem with is character hair. But, but gender? Stop sacrificing your own culture to pander to America. Stop it. You glazing. Stop glazing the American penis. I don't play Monster Hunter to learn about my fucking gender, nigga. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. I'll talk to y'all later. Oh, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you.